actually on. Oh no! <laughs> We've been off this whole time? No! Oh, wait, so... Recap on the commentary. We've been commentating this whole time. And now you're, now you're filled in. So, on to round three. Oh, I'm so sorry, folks. Wait a second. Alright. This good deal jumping that emulga as if it weren't even there into a combo into the wall. It, that looked like it missed, but hey, game physics. I, okay, I like the counter there because then you don't get pushed towards Garchomp to do other shenanigans. I actually had no idea this entire time that it didn't counter Pierce, because I thought it did. Um, the one up close definitely does. Yeah, the one he does around him does. All right. Only fully charged. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, does that? I don't think that's punishable. It seemed like it is when he was that high, but oh, I don't know. Maybe it's just looking back. But anyway. Damage. Damage. Just Um. <laughs> Honestly, uh, SK Dale's bringing a lot of pressure here. If he can just play it safe enough to stay away from Charizard Shandigan. Oh, he could have comboed But he's still got 37 seconds to go, and he's got to make some risks. Like that. Oh, man. How do you let that loose, too? Oh, me. Okay. Like, honestly, like, there there were just certain things that could have happened there that were kind of, like, um, I don't know. He could have let go of the counter earlier, and he wouldn't have gotten his own little frames caught. Um... And then the, uh, what was it, fire punch into the, the counter attack, I think? Probably. That or it's just counter into counter. Yeah. But the range on Garchomp's fully charged counter is, like, super good. But it's also low, so you can just, like, well, I don't, over there. I think, yeah, Eskita had to correct us one day. It's not a true low, it's like a mid-low or yeah, something. Yeah, mid-low or something. Safety happening. Yo. Okay. Like, these are big moves, and they're doing, like, 10 damage. Because <laughs> they keep clashing. Oh my <laughs> this gosh. is silly. <laughs> I got a cast, this is going to cast. Yeah. But it's going to nail in a corner. Okay, mix ups, but honestly a very risky option. Ah, uh, I didn't see it. Pagato has some space, and now he's left. Okay. Get the fire back punches, in that corner. Yeah, fire punches just are not working out here. Flare Blitzes are. Ooh. Was he fighting Sorry Tag where he just went through his HP like it was candy? Oh, it was funny that worked. Is probably gonna take it out. No? Okay, no. just kidding. No. And SK Dale using Fennekin because. Memes. <laughs> I've never seen him use Fennekin I've before. I've never seen him use Fennekin. Maybe like a year ago, but anyway. Let's see if it works. See, I would think Picano. Picano is getting more mileage off Fennekin than he is in Volga, so I, I think I would like to be switched back. But that's okay. If he likes Volga and it's working, that's good. That burst is a little bit of chip. Ooh. Oh, dang it. Questionable size big toss. Okay, that's Ooh, catch. it's gonna work. Yep. Okay. My mistake. The other one has worked twice this game. Yo, that was really good. That was really good! <laughs> I'm gonna get scaled. Yeah. That's some pretty good damage. Mm -hmm. Kind of played it safe. With nice spacing. His fire flamethrower, I think, is all that is. Something tells me he can high stance that. Okay, he's in. Okay. No. Ah. Ah. No. Oh. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Nope. Okay. So yep. Even if Eskidil could high stance it, I think technically he takes like half the damage or something. He takes reduced damage, in, but still face shift points. True. Oh no, we dropped it. Uh, uh, that works. Okay. That's why he used it. Okay. <laughs> Is that, that was that's not a brain. Yes. What the heck? He's got it works anyway. Fire punch, but... All right, so Eskidil's gonna take that 2-0. Is this his loser semis? Eskidel's gonna move into um, 